Good morning, good morning, good morning. <laughs> Today's another day. And the sun is creeping into the courtyard this morning. <laughs> Not bursting into it, just sort of creeping, easing its way into the courtyard. It's beginning to, you can tell the seasons are changing when the sun makes a different kind of cast of sunlight in the mornings. It's almost like you feel a dew outside. You know when you were a kid and you woke up in the morning and the grass was all covered in dew because the changing of the seasons is coming. And they sort of glisten like it's got glitter. Somebody just, you know, like sprinkled glitter all over the grass and the flowers and just before they start turning that brown color you know what I'm saying well the sun has given me a hint this morning that the season of the fall is coming I do believe it is I guess that means the exit of our butterflies our bees will still be around I think I really don't know but anyway, good morning to you. Good morning, good morning. Wow, it's been a busy morning this morning. I've been thinking and a thinking. Yes, I have. Oh, where's up there she is? There, Gigi. Good morning, Gigi. Good morning, Miss Spot. <laughs> you know what? They like me so much, they never go away. <laughs> I believe in miracles. Yes, I do. <laughs> you know, it is it is what it is. You know, when you uh, lose somebody in your life, or they leave you, that's their choice to leave you, uh, or you pass through friends that seem to just vanish. Just like I'm still here. They're they're going other places. They're going to who knows where. I was looking this morning on Facebook, and um, it says, "Would you like to join this club, this um, group?" And it says, "Do you like vintage campers?" And I was thinking, "Oh, a new adventure." Could I live in a little bitty camper about this big, me and my little three pals? <laughs> and I said, I believe in miracles. I said, sure. <laughs> so now I'm a group of vintage camp, I mean, vintage campers group, if they approve me. Of course, they ask you the questions, you know. Are you going to be very nice when you're on there? You don't say any dirty words or cause any problems. And I said, please and thank you to let them know that I knew my manners. And then I said, then I said, please and thank you. And then I said, yes. I figured that would cover it. Then the next question was, why are you coming to this site? I said, I'm looking for a new adventure. This might be it. A finished camper. Then the next question said, uh, I can't remember. Well, I, I'm sure it must have been very, very important for them to have a third question on there. And I'm sure I answered it wisely. Well, they haven't approved my membership in the group yet, but we'll see, won't we? We'll see. And another thing I learned today is I didn't realize September is National Bee Month or something. And I'm trying to find all the details on it, but I hadn't been able to find the details. So I'm going to be looking for more details. And I'll put it in descriptions because... You know, I didn't even know there was a National Bee Bee Day, a Bee Month, Bumblebee, not a bee like I be you be. No, that's not right either, is it? <laughs> oh well. <laughs> oh well, 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 well. Oh, and now what? But what, what else is I going to say? Oh yes, and my sister came over yesterday. 
She brought me this. You see this? It's about, it's not your regular cardboard. It's a, almost a half an inch thick, I would think. Well, the mission is, if I sh should choose, is to take, you know, the uh, continue the project of my kitty cats instead of making a pillow this time. Of course, I'm gonna cover this, uh, you know, thing board, and make this into a um, hanging instead of a. Well, you know what I mean, a hanging, because she has a room in her house, her bathroom, her guest bathroom, and it's got all her kitty paintings in it. And she said, me, me, you know, that she would consider, after I blocked it and everything, to hang it in her bathroom, her kitty cat room, which the kitty cat room has her paintings in it, little sculptures, all kinds of cute little kitty things. I think even uh, she has eyeglass case in there she painted. It had a kitty cat face on it. But anyway, this would be something I'm considering. Of course, I've got to figure out how to cover this if I need to put cotton underneath it or some kind of blanket or something to help it but it would be I don't know you know on the on the uh, I have this started you know as a border kind of thing going on but I'm not sure if that's where we're going with that but I thought well if I do this I can always add more adornments to it because it's going to be on the wall. It won't be, uh, you know, on a couch or a bed or anything like that where the uh, embellishments uh, would be threatened <laughs> by abuse. <laughs> but uh, we we'll just take a thirty. But anyway, that's a project of. I, I may consider, you know, she's very good at ideas. Both my sisters are just geniuses, in fact. But anyway, could be a possibility. A work of art, a hanging work of art on crochet. Yeah, it might work out good. Anyway, that's what this board is for. So this is a work in progress. <laughs> I'll put it over here, out of the way. Oh, excuse me, sorry about that. <laughs> so we've talked about our butterfly. No, we didn't talk about our butterflies. I'm gonna post some pictures. Um, my daughter's best friend uh, went to St. Louis with her to see her grandchildren, I think, is why she went up there. Anyway, she posted some pictures. She went to the uh, St. Louis, uh, I guess it's a planetarium. Not planetarium, that's, that's space, isn't it? This is uh, Botanic Gardens. Or, anyway, they've got all of these butterflies. And one of the, uh, well, you'll see the picture, but you can see there's a plate with some fruit on it and the butterflies look down on it. Very, very cute pictures. I'm going to uh, go ahead and post those in this video so you can see them. And also the information about the bee, uh, what did I say it was? The bee month. Yeah, the bee month. Okay, let's see. I'm going to get... Do y'all remember that song? It says, We'll Sing in the Sunshine. Do you remember that song? I don't know. Maybe you do. Maybe you don't. I will sing in the sunshine. Da-da-da-da-da. I don't remember how it goes. 
but it's by Gail Garnett, G-A-R-N-E-T-T, and it was recorded in 1963. I'll sing in the sunshine. I wish, and maybe I can, use that as a theme on one of my videos. Wouldn't that be pretty? We'll sing in the sunshine. Gosh, I wish I knew the rest of the words. I'll work on that. I'll work on that. If you already know them, sing them to me. <laughs> sing them to me. That would be great. You can sing them to me and send me your video and I'll put you up and you can sing. <laughs> or play the piano. So wouldn't that be cool? That'd be a lot, a lot of fun. First one's from Bonnie Myers. It says, I've got one blanket almost finished for Christmas gift. Of course, I started it last year. That's <laughs> <Last> Christmas. <laughs> and I don't like fringes. You know, I don't either. But you know, that was the style back then. Just fringes everywhere. And they're always nodding up and look so untidy. And I don't usually have WIPS because I usually finish one project before starting another. One. You're such a show-off, buddy. <laughs> but we love you just the same. <laughs> and congratulations on the Christmas gift. Even if it took two years, it's okay. It's okay. It's still a gift, right? <laughs> oh, let's see. Oh, here's Jill. Well, I'm sure happy you're down mood left and you were up and ready to face your day. Yes, Jill. <laughs> well, I had me a lazy day. Oh, you did, did you? I just did the basics and was lazier than all get out. <laughs> then, at, then at the end of the day, I was mad at myself. Mima. T-T-Y-L means talk to you later. I can't figure out how to send you a picture. I'd like to show you my FOs when I get them done. What's FO? That means finished objects. <laughs> I don't know. I don't know. I have to look it up. Mirabelle let me know. Sometimes she jumps in there and lets me know. <laughs> Somebody does. Maybe it's <laughs> You know who knows it. Uh, yes, I'll just send you my email. You can send me some photos and I'll put them up. I will. And if you send them right now, I'll put them on this video. <laughs> Wouldn't it be cool? Say, yes, yeah, spontaneous combustion. <laughs> no, no. Good to hear you. <laughs> and I know, after your day's all over and you haven't done anything, you go, wait a minute. I didn't do anything today. You know, the day went by. I lost that day. I don't know, I've, I've been there. I've been there. Mary Bell says, You're cracking me up having a pity party. Glad you got up and got some things done. Bet it felt good. Yes, it did. And I was giving myself a pity party. I mean, I was just so down and out. I didn't want to get out of bed. No. But I did and I got a lot of things done. And on top of that, sister come over and brought me the cardboard, you know, for the for the kitty cat uh, hanging, if I choose to do that. And she took me to get a haircut. Oh, I'm so happy. I'm so happy. I didn't even put anything in my hair yet because I didn't want to mess it up from yesterday. <laughs> but the young man, he did a really good job on my hair. I like going to him. And she took me and she got her hair trimmed too. So we had a really good day flea marketing and stuff and she bought a, a, a chest and the knobs on it had all different colors on it so the, yesterday I got out I was so happy <laughs> of course I'm hurting today but I don't care I had a good day and uh, the pain's gonna always be there anyway <laughs> so, so I'm moving on moving on Okay, and oh, here we go. Daniel, hello, hello from Montreal. I just saw your video on my Google feed. 
It's 8.20 p.m. Your presentation is a wonderful with them of Lone Ranger. The dynamics of the music got me out of my chair to start supper. Woohoo, Ranger! You know, I love TV and other people had them, but I always wanted one. I thought, wouldn't that be me to have my own Lone Ranger? sitting in my room, get up in the morning, play William Tell Overture, and then watch him. Well, I'm washing dishes, listen to William Tell Overture. Oh, well, we have imagination. There you go. Well, the shamrock shawl is finished. I am doing a simple border for it. So glad because I, it had to be finished for Thursday for my family reunion. So, I will be able to video about it tomorrow, which means today, and sharing a few moments because I have a few more subscribers to say a special hello to. Have a wonderful evening. Stay in the loop. Okay, well, it sounds like you're on a roll. Everything's falling into place. Everybody's just doing their thing, and I'm so happy for y'all. And I am happy for me, and I'm going to close this morning because I've been talking long enough, and I and I want to have a second cup of coffee, and I hope you have, and have a great, great, great day because you are special, and God has has you in the palm of His hand. Pray for Mother Earth, our butterflies, and our bees. And I'll see you tomorrow. Bye-bye.